Alright, welcome to this video. I'm Pilot Luke and today I'll be showing you what we do on the pre-flight checklist to see if this aircraft is fit to fly. So on the left side, mind it doesn't hit here. I'll turn the batteries on and this for a simple reason we're going to be checking if the stall detector is working. So the stall detector is located on the right wing. If it sounds, it's working. So now we can go ahead and turn the batteries off. So now we can start the check of the plane. So first thing we're going to be checking is the fuel level inside the plane. So we need to remove the protection on top. We're going to use this tool going to measure how much fuel we've got so we're at level 8 so that's 43 liters on the left make sure to close it and we're going to write down on our sheet 43 so fuel left is 43 now let's move on to the right wing So we make sure nothing's going to fall apart and we also check the pressure of the tire so everything's perfect. Let's move on. So we just pass a finger on top of here, make sure nothing's going to fall apart and make sure to pass your finger to make sure that there is no damage. So here there's a little bit of a loss in paint but that's not going to affect our flight. So make sure nothing's blocking this and here we come to the other ones so make sure that they are moving freely like so to make sure everything is okay. Then also what we'll need to do is um, put the flaps out, so let's go ahead and do that. Ciao. Okay, what we're checking here as well is the flaps and then what nice is sustained and we're also checking for the plastic part located right here, making sure that this is nice and it won't fall off. Flaps are good. So now let's move on. Here we check the antenna. If it's nice and then turn in place. Check for any damage on the aircraft. Um, so here we're coming over to the elevators. So the elevators will just lift it up very gently. Make sure to never touch the trim. There it's free. Here we just check basically if there's any damage on the antennas and on the tail. Where we've got our plastic part for the flaps, make sure the flaps are nice and nicely sustained. And well, here we go back to the ailerons over here, lift it slowly and gently, and then in both directions, make sure they're free. Pass our finger over, make sure the lights, the strobe lights, are attached well. Continue here. We've already measured if this, if the uh, stall warning is working. Nothing to be said. All good. The static source is good. Now let's make sure that our wing is nicely supported and that our wheels are in place and that the tire pressure is okay, yeah, it's fine. And now let's make it to the engine. So we've got the engine, so we'll just unclip these. There we go. So 
So this is for the old level. The old level can be measured by just taking this cap off and then we're just going to need to do a simple turning process. So first thing before turning the first thing before turning the propellers we must make sure that our ignition is nice and off because the aircraft if it's on on it could start any time so it's for our own security. So here the ignition is on off right here as you can see and the keys are out of the way so we do not have any problems. So let's go and check the oil level. And then once we've checked everything, just close it. Make sure that these are under those little parts right there. So you can fit your, your nail under them. There we go, perfect. Do the other, same thing on the other side to check the cooling. So here's the coolant level. Um, it's, it's fine right there at this level. It's in between minimum and maximum, which is perfect. And then we just check if any, if there are any uh, problems or anything that's been left behind by a maintenance person or any student, then no, we're good. Do the same thing as before. And now, put some fingers under here. And now, I'm just going to check if uh, the front is nice and fit. So, landing light is okay. Here, everything is seems to be good and then come back down to the, to the tire and the support and everything's good so the aircraft is now fit to fly